Statements are set to begin in the trial for one of the people charged in the murder of two families in Pike County. This case is extremely rare in the state of Ohio and in the whole country for that matter. It, it all stemmed and all started because of, of a custody dispute between the two families. So it's just a tragedy that a lot of people are scratching their heads with. How did it get this far? We, of course, are talking about the Pike County Massacre, the deaths of eight members of the Roden and Gilly families. We've followed this case since 2016 when these eight people were shot and killed. Two years later, four members of the Wagner family were arrested. Jake Wagner had a child with one of the victims, Hannah Roden. His brother and his parents have all been charged with crimes related to those killings. My understanding is the evidence is going to show that the Wagners voted on everything that they did, you know, as far as how they would carry it out, who would be involved in it. And they are going up against it, each other. And I've been doing this for a lot of years. I've never seen that before. Jake Wagner pleaded guilty last year as part of a deal that spared him from a death sentence. The mom, Angela, also has pled guilty. So far, the dad not, has pled not guilty, and Jake's brother, George IV, is the one headed to trial this week. Again, opening statement set to begin tomorrow. If he is convicted, he could face the death penalty. Happy